Breakfast, big day, ball flying. I make us get up really early. We have to be ready, rolling in the truck at 7 a.m. So, five something. Another day. morning uh, they wake us up bright and early it's about, it's right at about six seven o'clock in the morning we're gonna go do a sight lap in the truck after that we got a couple minutes to regroup and then we go out and do our thing should be pretty good stack field we got over 40 trucks in the spec class I think it's gonna be a pretty exciting day of qualifying and uh, see how it ends up don't really know how this course is I've never been here they say it's really sandy or claims that it's gonna be less sandy this year, but we're in the sand dunes, so <laughs> yeah, we're gonna have to see. I think it'll be a good one though. Yeah, did you? We were doing donuts on the parade lap. We were lost. We were out in the lake bed. And then we were running backwards on the course. Wave at everybody when they went by. here in San Felipe for the San Felipe 250 uh, score international. Uh, qualifying went really good yesterday. Um, right where I wanted to be, I ended up fourth in the spec TT class. Um, I kind of just took it easy, made sure the truck stayed in one piece. So really happy to be starting right up there with the front guys. And uh, it's gonna be a long sprint um, tomorrow. So I think being fourth is a good sh strategic move. So many people get us here, and I can't thank them enough for making this all possible because this is truly a dream. I remember standing here on the other side of the fence 
just a couple years ago, googly eyes at trophy trucks, and now I'm lucky enough to drive one. So we're here just finishing up at Tech and Continuity for the race. Uh, so basically we roll down Malacon, the main street. They uh, go through the truck, make sure it looks good and make sure it's safe, obviously. Um, but the rest of the day, I'm gonna hang out a little more down here, interact with some fans. Have a good one. I'm gonna hop in my pre-runner, go run about 50, 60 more miles, just try to finalize those notes. So tomorrow, on the big day, uh, we got everything unlocked, but then I'm going to bed because we got an early day tomorrow and uh, it's gonna be an early, long day. There we go. Thank you, nice seeing you. Yeah. Good luck. Finished running around the Malacon, hanging with some people. Got the Razor. We're gonna go uh, pound some miles. This is the last time. Hopefully, the old girl pulls through. But uh, I'm off. I'm just gonna be bittersweet being our last time in the girl. But I'm also very excited. Dusty, huh? <laughs> yeah, a little dusty. Okay, just burning a couple more miles before we uh, hop on the trailer. Just got a little bit of fuel in the UTV. Um, my dad and his friends stopped in to say what's up um, while we had a little snack. He's gonna go back, get ready, and uh, we're, we're gonna do a couple more miles and then end up uh, going and doing some rest and Bryce's gonna finalize our notes but it's pretty cool when Pops drops in like this. It's still a, still a wow factor, definitely. Shocks were not a thing. Race morning, I'm um, all suited up. We're gonna head down to the Malacon right now to start staging. 
Everything's uh, ready. The team, we've done our homework. All the chase crews, pit guys, they're all ready. And now it's time to do our thing and uh, go have some fun and be safe. It's gonna be a long, but also a really short day. So, you know, it's only a five hour race. Uh, so it's, it's a sprint. Oh, I'm, it's beyond, uh, yeah, it's so stoked to be up here. Uh, my team and I put a lot of hard work in and uh, our day started off uh, pretty rough. So to be here, I'd say there's definitely a little luck on our side, but you know, some hard work too. Dude, talk about a race. That was, I was one for the books, definitely. If you told me I was gonna be here, I would've said no way. We had so many ups and downs, so to be here, now we're gonna celebrate a little. I keep like looking back and like, dude, someone's gotta be pulling in, so unreal. Um, it feels good to be here. You know, the team put a lot of hard work in. So to now win this thing, after all the battles, and my team really pulled through, you know? They, they were there for me where I, when I needed them, and I'm just thankful to be here. Safe, now it's time to celebrate a little, and uh, have some good times down here in Baja.